Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial of Looker Studio. In this tutorial, we are going to dive into two fundamental concepts of Looker Studio that are look and dashboard. These are the building blocks for your data visualization and data exploration through Looker Studio. So, let's get started. What are looks? Looks are the foundation of your data exploration in Looker Studio. Think of a look as a saved query or a report that defines how your data should be extracted or presented in a Looker Studio. It's like having a lens to view your data in different ways. Key features of looks. Data queries. Looks allow you to query your data. You can choose which data sources to use and specify the dimensions like categories or time and measures like counts or sum you want to analyze. Visualizations. You can visualize your data in various ways, including charts, tables, and maps. Looks give you the power to turn raw data into a meaningful insights. Filters. Looks can have filters that allow you to focus on specific subsets of your data. These filters make it easy to perform detailed analysis. Now let's talk about the dashboard. Dashboards are like canvas that brings multiple looks to create a data story. These are the final output that you can share with others. Key features of dashboards include Composition Dashboards enable you to compose and arrange your looks, visualizations and text elements to tell a coherent data story. You have full creative control. Interactivity you can make your dashboards interactive. This means users can apply filters, drill down into data, and explore the insights you have prepared for them. And sharing. Once your dashboard is ready, you can easily share it with your colleague or stakeholders. Luca provides options for sharing with the platform or embedding in other applications. Now let's see how can we create a simple look and uh, form it into a dashboard. Creating a look, we will start by creating a look. We will choose our data source, select dimensions and measures, apply filters and choose a visualization type. Adding to a dashboard. Once our look is ready, we will add to a dashboard. We can create a new dashboard or add it to an existing one. Then we will arrange and customize the look within the dashboard. Before we wrap up, here are some practical tips that naming conventions use descriptive names for your looks and dashboards to keep things organized consistency maintain a consistent style and layout across your dashboards for a professional look user feedback gather feedback from users to improve your looks and dashboards over time so that's it for tutorial on look and dashboard on looker studio looks are the way that you analyze or visualize your data and dashboards help you to tell a compelling data story. In the next tutorial, we will dive deeper into the creating customized looks. Stay tuned.